Er. Hey, what's up, guys? It's Pat, and welcome back to Minecraft Epic Proportions. And today's a very special day. We finally hit 100,000 subscribers. Honestly, I can't believe it, and I just wanted to say thank you so much to you guys. And, um, yeah, today we're going to do a special long episode for it. I know normally people do, like, a vlog to say thank you or something, but I figured you guys subscribe to see Minecraft videos, and most people have been asking for a longer episode anyway, so I figured it was the perfect time to do it. Um, oh, I did one thing off camera. I made a washing machine. There was a couple of suggestions in the comments to make one because I can, like, repair my gear with it, and it seems to have worked. I made it off camera, though, because I didn't want to look like an idiot not knowing how to use it. It's actually really easy. Like, all come out of there all right so I can't like shift click it out but all you do is put in your armor put in some coal and you can repair your whole set at the same time although it takes like 10 minutes it took like 10 minutes to repair that but it, but anyways we're finally like feeling strong again which is good oh guys I keep forgetting to do this every time these creeper statues they are so cool so they need to be like right here doesn't that look cool only problem now with this room is, like, um, the throne is really bad. Like, do I want a wood throne? Probably not. I'm gonna get rid of this. And we're gonna improve it right now before we leave. Oh, I figured today would be a perfect time for the dungeon that was underneath the fire demon place. Because it takes a really long time to do. And since we're gonna do a long episode, it should work out, I hope. Alright, so I have these emeralds, right? And I have these gold blocks. I don't have quite enough emeralds yet. So this is what I'm thinking. Like, we need cool blocks, obviously, and you don't really use emeralds too much. So I'm thinking this for now. Until I get all emeralds, then I'll replace the gold ones. How's that look? Not too bad, right? Better than wood. I want to sit on emerald. And kind of the yellow goes with the, the yellow floor, too. And I got the creeper statues now, so it looks a lot better. Only weird thing about this room, washing machine. I know, I, I put it in the throne room, but what are you going to do? So, uh, I think we're gonna head off and out of this place. I'll show you guys how one of the buildings is coming along. The Simucraft people are, are working hard. They might need more materials. They keep asking for so much stuff. It looks like they're, they've stopped. Oh, I should put these gold blocks down. I don't want to bring them with me. I'm trying to, like, you know, have a free inventory. Because we're probably gonna get a ton of different things. Put that down. They probably need this wood. I'll just give it to them. Alright, let me put these diamonds down. Alright, it is time to go. Hopefully I can find it, because I don't know exactly where it is. But first, Simucraft people, I'm coming. What do you need? I, I guarantee you she needs something. She keeps asking me whenever I go by. Wool. Oh, God, the one thing I don't have, really. Um, I gave her some wool already. I might have had a couple pieces of wool. I definitely don't have enough that I need. What we need to do is really get a sheep farm going. That's probably the next thing I'm going to do once she finishes this house. Have her build that. <laughs> All right, so I'll let them continue on building... I don't want to spend too much time trying to get, like, wool right now. Because, honestly, it takes a long time to do some of these Simucraft things. Actually, there's a sheep right there. Come here. I'm so sorry. All right, there's one wool for you. Now continue to build. This happens to be a sheep right around. All right. Okay. Build. I, I gave you the wool. Will you build? Building spacious house. Now waiting for more wool. Damn you. <laughs> Didn't work out very nicely, did it? Any more sheep around? Just happened to be. So if there it is, I will, I will chop them into pieces and give them to her. I guess not. I already killed, like, a bunch that were around here anyway, trying to, you know, give her enough wool. I don't really like to steal it from my nice buildings. I hate to do that. That's why I got to start the sheep farm. But it's time for us to leave. And the good thing is, guys, I'm trying to, like, save up all my experience levels right now. I know I have 65, which is a lot. And you're probably like, Pat, you should enchant something. But no, I can't yet. Because I still need a couple more levels of, um, from the, like, you know, the health mod. A couple more. Almost got there. Okay, so I know it's somewhere around here. Because I was, like, up here the first time I ever loaded in. And I saw underneath the ground, like, around here somewhere. <laughs> I don't even know where. <laughs> We're just going to dig down and honestly hope for the best. Hope we can find it. Actually, I see a big hole over there. That could just lead us right in, maybe. Okay, that's not much of a hole, is it? <laughs> Alright, I know it was near Fire Demon. I know there's a lot of things around, too. We're just going to dig down from... Let's see. Did I have a shovel on me? Now, who, who needs shovels? They're for the weak. All right, I'm going to go down right here. I feel this is the spot. This right here. I'm feeling lucky. Please just drop me right in. Drop me right in. Come on. Oh, my God. Did it really drop me right in? Sort of. This, this spawned weird. Is this one of the rooms? Oh, no. There's the ceiling of it, isn't it? There's the ceiling of it. Oh, that is awesome. Here we go. So, yeah, this is a very intense dungeon, and there's there's a lot of spawners. Okay, creeper. <laughs> the first second, a creeper. 
<laughs> oh god, there's parts of him on the ground. Alright, before we actually get started in this place... Stop it! You have the block! Stop this. Alright, you fell apart. So what we're gonna do is switch to the Iron Golem, because I'm definitely gonna need the extra damage while I'm down here. Plus, if there's a creeper coming after me, he'll, you know, kill it. Alright, you know one thing I did a terrible job with? That was getting food. But, um, luckily, there's delicious cakes down here, which is pretty cool. Okay, so, lots of different rooms, lots of treasure chests, lots of spawners, lots of fighting. I am gonna try to be quick with these spawners, though, if I can. It should get us a bunch of levels. I know we're already at 65. Let's try to go, like, straight, like, every direction. That way I won't miss anything. All right, quickly. Don't spawn anything. Doing good so far. Oh, man, there's so many directions. Oh! You scared the heck out of me. All right. Yeah, get him. Kick his ass. He's in gold armor. He's, like, throwing him towards the ceiling. All right, I got him. Oh, he actually dropped his helmet. It's very dark in that room, isn't it? I have a feeling we're going to get really lost down here. There's a bunch of dark rooms over here. There's nothing in them. All right. So we'll go this way. And as you can tell, there's like 100,000 rooms. <laughs> oh, my God. Okay, so that's the way down to the next floor. But obviously, we still have a lot to check out over here. All right, kill him. Get him. Actually, you know what we should do? Is we should set a waypoint. Okay, so to next floor. That way, I can get back to it really quick after we explore all these rooms. Out of the way, zombie. Out of the way. Kill him. <laughs> I love that mod that makes them fall apart like that and blood everywhere. It is awesome. Alright, so we'll go this way. I love how far you can hit them from. Like, I am nowhere near them. Alright, get him. I don't even have to fight. But I like to. Alright, give me that experience. Alright, give me some cake. A little bit hungry. It's nice to have the food down here. It's so useful because you can easily run out of food. Oh, a chest. Awesome. First one. Okay, so enchanted books. I'm not going to grab those, but since we're low on food, I'm going to give them my sand and grab this bread. Because there's Bane of Arthropods, um, Knockback, Thorns 2, and Knockback. And I need the. I can already get those from my enchanting, you know, plus, so it doesn't really matter. It's kind of interesting that there's farms down here. Down here for a long time. Grow some wheat. Alright, is this the one I just went to? Yes, it is. <laughs> Everything goes around a circle. It confuses me easily. Okay, so as we go further down, there are diamonds and stuff like that, too. So it's definitely going to be interesting to see what we get here. And the rooms get cooler, too. I think I've completely explored it now. All right, don't, don't follow me. So the way down is right here. Awesome. So I'm going to do this on every floor, I think. And we're going to remove this. That, that's not how you remove it. Hold on here. Okay, M. Waypoints. So two next floor. Okay, remove. X, there we go. So, yeah, I don't want to have, like, too many that say two next floor. Oh, here we go. Quickly. Get that one out. So, if I run for these really quick, I can take them out before too many spawn. There's, oh, God, a blaze spawner over there. So, yeah, there are blaze spawners, too, and the blaze spawners are really freaking annoying. All right, run for the spiders. Oh, God, the spider got me, and I'm getting attacked by a blaze. For some reason, I got a crash, guys. I don't know if it has to do with this dungeon or what, really. I mean, maybe so many mobs are spawning, but I really have no idea. Every crash we've had in the series has been in this, like, general area, though. So I thought it might be caused by this dungeon and, like, massive amounts of mobs spawning. The thing is, this actually goes all the way down to the bottom of the world. So maybe... I I'm not really sure. If you guys have any idea what, like, exception ticking world means, that's the crash I'm getting. So maybe I could fix it if um, someone could let me know. All right, so there's a lot of blazes. A lot of them die. Okay. Kill this one. Dead. Awesome. We make a great team, Iron Golem. Okay, so I got the blaze spawners. That should make everything a little bit easier, I would think. Give me some food. I'm starving. I love these cakes. All right, these weird dark rooms. Until you, like, walk in. Okay, so another blaze over there. Stop shooting fire at me. Don't, don't do that. All right, it died. Iron Golem's killing everything. He's a beast. Okay. Which, okay, so this is the way down to the next floor, right here. So I probably should set to next floor on this one, too. To next floor. There we go. Okay, so let's see. There's got to be some chests and stuff around here, too, that we can get. Get that. All right, how about this way? So many different ways. I'm getting the spawners really quick, though. Which I have to, or there'd be monsters everywhere. All right, come on, some awesome chests. All right, if we go this... Okay, there we go. 
A music disc, cool. I mean, you don't get music discs too often, so it's always nice to get one. Another spider spawner. Awesome. Okay, so anything else down on this floor? I don't think there is. Not too many chests so far, but the further we get down, like, the better rewards we get. All right, give, give me some cake. There we go. So, that chest right there is the one we just went to, right? I need to confirm that. I get lost here. Okay, so, to the next floor. I don't think we've missed anything here, so we are heading... Oh, God, that doesn't sound good, does it? Kill them from here! We could kill them from, like, uh, without even jumping down. Oh, it's a magma cube. A skeleton. Alright, let me take that out. Awesome, got the spawner. Okay, so, okay, now the crazy stuff is coming. Crazy stuff. <laughs> I didn't even mean to hit him. I meant to hit the ghoul. Okay. So let's see here. I don't know if there's spawners for those down here. Just die. Alright, so we'll kill all these. You can see now there's actually... Oh, a hook horror. Keep him away from me. They actually rip your weapon out of your hand, which is extremely annoying, you can imagine. There's a ton of them, too. So yeah, things are getting more difficult now. Hello? I didn't even see you. Iron Golem's really protecting me. And this is to the next floor, too. Okay. Next floor. And I probably should get rid of the other one again, so let me do that real quick. I wrote two next floor on one of them. Okay, so I'll remove that. There we go. So yeah, oh, you scared me, Iron Golem. He ran by me. Well, you, of course he ran by me. He's like part of me. And it freaked me out a bit. Oh, one thing I should have done is gotten um, fortune on my pickaxe. Totally forgot that. It's all right, though. I mean, we're going to get so much stuff, it's not really going to matter too much anyway. I mean, how many diamonds do I need? I'm sure we'll see diamonds down here. I hope so, at least. Be a little bit sad if we don't. But yeah, there's rooms like this filled with ore, which are always nice. I think there's redstone ones, too. I'm probably not going to worry too much about those. Let me just take out this spawner. It's going to bother me. Then I'll go back. Because I don't want, like, a thousand mobs spawning as I'm trying to get my ore. But yeah, this is from uh, Dungeon Pack, if you're wondering. I'm pretty sure that's the mod it's from. It's kind of a rare structure, so I'm always happy to, like, find something like this. It's dark in here. Saddles! Awesome! That's exactly what I wanted. And a golden apple. I love you. Alright, I already have, like, a bunch of these. I'm probably gonna go without those. Flame one, projectile one. So what I'm gonna try to do, guys, is try not to take too much crap. I know I do it a lot. I try not to. I can't help it. Oh, zombie pig. Are we under the biome? I didn't... You don't have to be mean to him. You don't... You don't have to... Oh, well. Let's just do this. Okay, we'll go this way. But yeah, guys, I really wanted to say thank you so much for 100,000 subscribers. I kind of wanted to mention that, you know, throughout the video. Um, when I first started YouTube... Oh, God. <laughs> didn't think this would be happening. No, when I first started YouTube... I definitely didn't expect to get this many viewers, and I really appreciate it. I love to put up content. I'm so glad that people enjoy it, and I will continue to do so. And that's why I'm making a longer episode of this. I know, like, normally, like, someone would have, like, some kind of weird, like, special thing planned. Usually I don't do that, because I'm not good at that, but... I figured this would be perfect, because people really enjoy this series, so a longer episode makes the most sense to me. Alright, so yeah, that I don't really need. I don't need a tripwire hook either. Okay, so yeah, I'm trying to keep organized here. And let's see. So yeah, if you're wondering why sometimes my episodes are a little bit short, I know some people say they're a little shorter than they'd like. You know, they prefer like a longer 30-minute episode or something. What I try to do for my channel, like I know everyone has like their own thing. Why is it so dark? There we go. What I try to do is put up a lot of content, you know, for you guys, like three videos a day is usually what I average. And um, when I do that, I can't really make really long episodes. I know a lot of channels, like, do, like, you know, like, 30-minute, like, Let's Play episodes. But they only put up one video a day. So what I try to do is have, like, a variety of content in multiple videos a day. And that's really the reason that I keep them short. And, um, but today's special. So I want to do something extra long. And I figured this dungeon would be amazing. And I, I'm loving it so far. I have so much gold ore. It means I can make golden apples. All right. So let me finish this up. I need more cake. Anyone noticing that? Chest. Okay, let's see here. Another saddle. Awesome. We're going to have so many things from animal bikes when we're done. I'm going to grab the redstone. No, I'm not. I'm not. I don't need it. I get too crazy. Let me grab another bucket. It stacks. Okay, let's see here. Oh, zombie spawner. Hoping for cake or I'm just going to start eating soon. I mean, we have a lot of health. Okay, so he's dead. Oh, diamonds. Did you see that? The corner of my eye. Hold on. One second. Whoops. Didn't mean to do that. That's where I came from. I keep checking the same things over and over again. But this is beautiful. This is a beautiful room. 
Okay, so this is why we're here, guys. For the diamonds. Great rewards. I can make anything I want now. This many diamonds. So what's there? Five in every corner. So 20 in a room. Oh, man. I wish I had fortune, but uh, it's not a big deal. I mean, how many will we need? Who knows? It's morning now. Didn't even know it was nighttime. That may actually have been part of the crash reason, too. It could have to do with mobs out at night as well or something like that. I really have no idea. I mean, I put the mod pack together myself, so I'm not surprised there are a few issues with it. I mean, I I'm the one who did it, so. All right, another music disc. Awesome. Let me put these away. Don't need those. Don't need this. Don't, don't need the coin or this wood. All right, this is a really big floor, right? Oh, next floor. We're onto it. So we just went all around everything, I think. Down we go. All right, Cole over there. Hello, zombie. Get him, Iron Golem. Where are you? There you are. You're being lazy. All right, let me get this quick. Oh, God. Let me just get the blaze spawner. Those drive me crazy. Quickly get the blaze spawner. Awesome. All right, another blaze spawner. Running for him. You can see there's like red sun and coal rooms. And this is the way down to the next floor. Okay, cool. Oh, food. Thank God. Give me, give me that cake. It's delicious. Thank you. All right, I feel much better now. So we will, um, let's get rid of the other one. I think this is the easiest way to do it. So I actually like know like where I'm going and what I'm doing. Next floor. I know we went in this dungeon in the last series and I was quite a bit lost on the floor. So this is working out better so far. I remember last time I did like, uh, I remember my first series. I did a special like episode for, um, for subscribers, it was 5,000. I can't believe we're up to 100 now. That's like 20 times as many people. It, it is so awesome to see. I'm so, I'm so happy, guys. Um, I really do appreciate that you guys watch my videos. Okay, so how much redstone do we really need here? Like, a stack. I'm not going to overdo the redstone. Then we're going to have way too much stuff in our inventory. You know what we can do, actually? Is, like, put some stuff in here. All right, I have a bunch of goodies. 24 diamonds, not bad. Okay. Um, I'll just toss, like, so much stuff in here. I don't need this on me right now. Maybe the bread. Keep that on me. Spider bike. I'm probably not going to be riding you around in here. Okay, there we go. I'm keeping pretty organized today. You should be proud of me, because normally it's pretty bad. Okay, so let's look around here. I've been doing very good, too, at keeping, like, the spawners killed as quick as I can. Nothing that way. I think there's a spawner right around here. Where'd it go? I swear I just saw it a second ago. Some experience over here. Hello, skeleton. Die. Die. All right, we've got him. Oh, hello. Cole. Not going to grab it. I feel like it would be a waste of time and bag space to grab all that coal. I mean, coal is so common. Clearly, we're under the nether biome. We're not in a river anymore, are we? Yeah, we are. Oh, I made them aggressive. I forgot because I, I was fighting them before. Kill him. Your friends are here. They can't even get to me because the iron golem. I lied. He just hit me. All right, we got him. Okay, another chest. They were guarding it. In here, bread. Cool. <laughs> Fire aspect two. I'm breaking two. Knockback two. I'm breaking one. And one thing I noticed from the enchanting mod, it's changed. Because I know it used to be different where I could choose as much stuff as I wanted. And I don't think they have on breaking on it anymore. So that is the time I'm going to grab that. Hopefully, I didn't miss any other breakings. Not a big deal, though. I mean, <laughs> whatever. I'm sure we'll find better stuff than I'm breaking, too, anyway. Okay, so I see a spawner right there. And a, it's really dark in here. Zombie pigmen are always pissed at me. Now they are. <laughs> All right, let me kill this. Kill the spawner. But I think that is the first unbreaking one that we saw, at least so far. Hello? I didn't even see you. What are you hiding in the corner for? Don't be afraid. I need some more cake. All right, we may have explored this whole floor here. We got the redstone. Um, before we go down, I'm just going to have some cake from over here. But yeah, we're getting deeper into the world, guys. We're actually doing pretty good. Let me see. So we are at 35. Just checking our, like, height. Okay, so we're in the corner here. How much of these, like, magma slimes around? It's because we're in, like, the nether. Okay, so if I go this way, leads me nowhere. Kill him. I love having the Iron Golem kill everything. Like, they're actually pretty strong. I mean, it definitely helps in the damage. Like, I, I didn't even help. And he owned him. Okay, so if I go this way. Chest. Yes. Another music desk. Cool. 
All right, so I'm trying to like collect the music discs at the moment. Break it, don't hit me. Nice job. All right, how about this way? Not too many dungeon mobs. The whole course, they scare me, but they're not too bad like um, in strength. There are some much tougher dungeon mobs, which we'll probably see as we get deeper. Okay, here we go again. So, waypoints. Next floor, let me remove this. I'm like getting better at using this. I'm doing it so much. Next floor. All right, there we go. Yes, okay. So, get a little bit of cake. All right, come on, I need some chests. We're not even to the bottom yet, where some of the really awesome, is that like a mine shaft? <laughs> it intertwines with it. Kill him. And I'm using my pickaxe because I'm, I'm too lazy to switch. But yeah, this definitely spawned cool. I'm not gonna go through it. I mean, it would take so long to go through that too. Plus, usually there isn't too much. Oh, hello. Blast off and regen, that's not bad. Um, blast off actually throws you into the air. Wh where can you throw me anyway? There's a ceiling. He's dead. Not too bad. A lot of zombie pigmen on this floor. A ton of them, actually. My bow is so strong, though. Oh, a bunch of iron ingots. I'll grab those, and I'll grab this. Plus, we need string for a bigger backpack. So, I'm going to try to grab all the string I ever see. You're hitting him from all the way over there. That's amazing. Is it me, or does this floor look really weird? What is this here? Could it be what I... Is this possible that it's at second one? Oh my god, is there two dungeons next to each other? Because that's ridiculous. Because they don't do this. That means there's two right next to each other. That must be what's causing this, um, the crashes. I don't know if it's loading of it, but there is a ridiculous, like, size to it. Especially if two are right next to each other. That's gotta be what it is. That's what I'm thinking. Alright, die, zombie pig man. Alright, well, I'm not gonna worry about going through two. That's just a bit much, isn't it? <laughs> it's good to know it's there, though. In case I need more diamonds, I can always, like, search it out. Let's way back up. Okay, so let me see. We have not gone this way. At least I don't think so. It's kind of confusing. Alright, I've definitely been to that chest. Maybe we have gone through it all. Okay, so the next floor is right over here. And I can't believe there's two right next to each other. That is pretty ridiculous. Okay, so let me get the spawner. Quickly, I see the zombie. Get him, yeah, teamwork. We have great teamwork. I'm gonna grab- Oh, see, now you see an enchantment table over there? There is better stuff coming. He'll kill him. I don't even need a help. I'm gonna grab my gold. And I can use these for, um... What I can do for the throne room is I can actually do the whole, like, carpet with gold blocks if I have enough gold. Which would definitely be cool looking if we could get enough. I kind of like to use my stuff like that. Like, I don't know. Like, I'm using my emerald blocks as a throne. It's awesome. Okay, so first, I probably should set my next waypoint, since I see the way down over here. Spiders. Okay. So quickly, remove this one, and add next floor. There we go. Awesome. So yeah, we're definitely getting low enough where soon we're going to be at the bottom floor of this place. I, I would imagine. <laughs> I would think so. Hopefully. Spider spawner. Owned. Oh, no, it didn't get owned. Okay, kill it. Kill it. So yeah, guys, um, this sword, what it does is um, it actually like picks up the items when you attack with it, which is very cool. I know we still need to check out like that meteor crash. I don't think it's anything special, though. I think it's kind of just, you know, meteor to mine, just like a bunch of mining. Grab these. Enchantment table. Need that. Oh, hold on a second here. Put you back down. It's going to work out brilliantly. So I'm thinking here. Oh, I can't enchant you because you already have unbreaking on you. Ah, I see. I see how it is. So what I wanted to do is put fortune on it. Hold on here. Give me a second to think this out. Okay, so if I put in, um, I swear I put down wood somewhere, didn't I? I swear I had wood. Okay, so do I have sticks on me by any chance here? Because I was thinking maybe if I made another diamond pickaxe while we're down here. And then enchant- I don't think it's gonna work out, because I think I put down my wood. Not a big deal, we probably won't even find any more diamonds anyway. Give me this brewing stand. It's free stuff. I love free stuff. Give me this, we haven't been in the nether yet. And right here... So, so- oh, another brewing stand. Oh god, this is where I start, like, gathering everything. Bookcases! I need them. But yeah, we actually do need bookcases, the thing. We need more books, because we need them for our, um, home. And this is the perfect place to take them, because I'm not going to be using this dungeon for anything anyway. Okay, that's a ton right there. Got like a little bit of lag as I grab them. They didn't want me to take them. Okay, so let me put a bunch of stuff in here. 
Like, we're definitely getting a lot of items at the moment. Okay, so that should be pretty good. Alright, lots of free space again. So let us tread on in this dungeon. I do need more cake. Okay, so that's to the next floor. And this way, that's where we came from. So we'll go this way. Come on, more chests and stuff. Hello! Scared me a little bit. <laughs> Just kill him. It's like head goes flying into the air. A molten sword! That's always cool. Okay, so what do we got here? Protection 3, projectile 1, smite 5, and looting 3. Alright. But any of those I can just choose, so not a big deal. Coal here. And this looks to be where it intersects once again. Let's just take a quick look. Diamonds? No. <laughs> just checking. You never know. If there were diamonds, I definitely would go in there and grab those. Okay. Another chest. Okay, so in this one. Aqua Infinity, Aqua Infinity, Sharpness, Protection, Feather Falling. And a bunch of stuff I don't really need. You know what we need to do, guys, is we need to find another mutant creeper so we can get, like, a new, like, pet. Like, remember Bami? Bami, that's sad. Sad memories, but it'd be nice to have a new pet like that. I'm just making sure I didn't miss anything here. I feel like I might have, but I'm, I'm not 100% sure. Yeah, I think I was there. I think it's time for the next floor. Did I? Okay, there it is. I was going to say, did I forget? I wonder if we're down to the bottom yet. We're def oh, God, Blaze Spawner. Just get it now. <laughs> there we go. Okay, let me just grab these spawners as quick as I can. Iron Golem's covering me right now. It's like three skeletons. Lots of mobs on this floor. I think I shot at him, but he knocked him into the air. All right, die spider. Die, die everything. So our height right now is 20. So there probably is another floor below this. Probably one more is what I'm thinking. So I'm looking for cake really badly. If we could find any cake, that'd be awesome. I don't like to use my food. Okay, here we go. Cake. Yes. Okay, so we're back up to um, full here. The brewing stand. I'm just going to grab all this stuff. Okay, so let me get that. Give me all this. It'll just stack with my other stuff anyway in the bag. All right, grab all these. Another enchantment table. Enchantment tables are cool. Plus, they're expensive anyway. Oh, you're rare. So he's killing a rare spawn for me. Go for it. Kill him. Get me some nice loot. Well, I grab these books for our uh, bookshelves at home that we definitely need really badly. Alright, he's almost dead. I'm just going to finish him off with one, like, shot there. Of course, I'm on fire. He did drop a diamond sword with fire aspect one and knockback one. That's not bad. It's very nice of him to do that. Okay, so you take that. And so the bag we just had open, let me try to stack everything in there that we can. Like this stuff. Like it all stacks, so I might as well just put it in here anyway. Okay, let's see. Anything else? All right, we're good. So we are getting deep into the world now. We're very far down, far from home. Oh, by the way, guys, one thing I forgot to mention. Since today is like a special day, and I wanted to show like appreciation to you guys, um, there is going to be more people in the fanchion than normal. I didn't say that at the beginning, so I totally forgot. I was going to actually say it, but I didn't say it. There's going to be 10 people today because I want you guys to have a chance to get in. I know there's like... I'm getting roughly a thousand comments per video on these, so I know it's hard to get in. So hopefully that'll give everyone like a little bit bigger of a chance to hopefully get into the fanchion. All right, so I'm gonna do that at the end though, or if there's like a great opportunity at some point. So this is to the next floor right here. Okay. I'm gonna just name it something else. Next one. I don't feel like nice spelling. I'll definitely know that's the one. All right, here we go. Spawner. There we go. You're dead. You are. What do you have? Ow. That wasn't nice. Why do you gotta do that? Die. Just just die. Give me that axe. Okay, so what's on this axe? Unbreak no, efficiency two. Cool. Okay, so where are we going here? This farm looks terrible. There's not even anything growing. This way now. I'm looking all over the place. I'm actually getting a little bit dizzy from this place, because there's so many different directions to go. It's making me a little dizzy. I'll be honest. Don't hit me. Okay, so experience probably from something I killed already. You can see, like, the, the cake thing over there. I came from here. I think it is time to go down to the next floor. I think so. So where is my thing I put down? There it is. 30 yards away. We're not going to grab the coal because we don't really need coal. And down we go. Lots of food for us. 
Lots of cake. What I've been trying to do so far is go right for the blaze spawners. I think I saw a way down to the floor even below this one. <laughs> That's fine, though. I want to get, like, the most out of this that we can. Like, bring home a ton of stuff. All right, what's in here? Silk touch. And silk touch. Bucket. Got a bucket. All right, iron ingot. And, um, I don't think there's anything else we really need in here. So, where was the way down? We came from here. I'm lost. A little bit. I don't need the redstone. Okay, so we'll make our way through this place. I see a skeleton spawner. Yeah, if you get these quick, we're actually up to level 70 now, which is pretty good. Definitely gonna... Oh, we gained a heart. I didn't even realize when we did that. We just need one more, I think. All right, so feather falling, blast protection, bread. Yes, more food. Need, like, as much food as we can get here. It is so dark. Is it me or is... What the hell is that? Oh, man. Intersecting once again. This is a very low mine shaft, I have to say. Cool, though. There's even, like, parts of it in here. Like, the spider webs and stuff are in here. And, like, parts of the wood. It is strange looking. Very weird. Never seen anything like this before. Yeah, I guess there's a really big mine shaft next to us. I don't even need to mess with the pig man. He's just killing them all for me right now. Okay, so we'll go this way. I'm a little lost. I think I just checked this one. Yeah. All right, so some wheat's actually growing on this floor. I see gold in this direction. All right, we'll go this way. Give me this. Give me this cake. All right, so nothing over there, nothing over there, but there's more gold waiting for us. So, yeah, I think we're definitely going to have enough to be able to make, like, gold blocks if we really want to, probably. Oh! Why you hit me? The other ones didn't hit me. That wasn't very nice at all. He wasn't even rare. Okay, so I'll grab every single one of these. I'm thinking we got more than a stack so far. Had to. Only one spot with diamonds, though, which is kind of sad, because I really... I love diamonds so much. Give me that. Yeah, this is why I cleared out my inventory and have three backpacks, because I knew we'd be getting a ton of different stuff today. And it's actually working out pretty good. I have not, like... Ooh, there's the next floor. I have not, like, fu filled up all the way. Last floor, it's got to be. It has to be. If it's not, then we're, we're going to be freaking underneath the world. That's not possible. It's not possible. All right, Silk Touch. I checked this one already. So I may have checked everything. I just want to make sure. I hear a dragon or something. <laughs> Sounded freaky, whatever it was. It's probably on the last floor. There aren't any actual, like, bosses, like, that go with this mod. But um, some stuff can spawn that's pretty crazy underneath the ground. Okay, anything this way? This might be it. On this floor. Alright, I think it's time to go down to the final floor. I spelled it really good, too, so you can see it right there. Last floor. It's gotta be. What are we at? We are at 15. Has to be. Something knocked me into the corner. I didn't do that. It was weird, actually. It wasn't you. I'm a little freaked out right now. I took a lot of damage from something. It's killing me. I don't want to die right now. I think I know what it is. Out of the way. I think it's the, the Rakshasa. I, I swear it's got to be. Those things are invisible. Well, they can go invisible and do a ton of damage. And I took a lot of damage, didn't I? That is bad. All right, so I'm kind of hiding right now. Stay away. You're scaring me. Stay away. This is my safe room. Safety room. Stay away. Okay. We're going to have to eat bread. We haven't had to do it yet. We're going to do it now. I need to get my health off. Protect me. Iron Comb's awesome. I don't even need to leave. They, you can't, they can't even get in here. All right, die, spider. Come on. Stop moving. Hate spiders. They're so annoying. There we go. So, yeah, there is something bad down here. The Rock Shasa hits extremely hard. If you saw, I dropped, like, six hearts in one hit. And that's why it's important that we have, like, this mod that gives us more health. Because we have a lot of mods installed that are very difficult. So let me put down some of this stuff. I'm going to grab my golden apples in case we need them. Since they're invisible, it's going to make it much more fun. All right. Okay, so I'll put this down. This down. This down. Um, that. My bucket. My books. My iron ingots. Okay. There's more to explore. We're on the final floor, and it feels like a boss fight almost. I hope the iron golem can hit it, even though it's invisible. All right. We're going to try to make our way through as safe as we can here. And I'm going to take down all the spawners. Maybe it despawned. That'd be nice. I don't want to die. 
I'd be really upset if I died, actually, since we're all the way down at the bottom. Oh, you scared me. It's a bone knight. What are you doing down here? What are you, what are you doing down here? Stay away. 80 health. It's a lot. All right, die. Okay, he's dead. Don't worry. Okay, so let me grab the... Oh, man, there's so many spawners on this last floor. There's so many. Okay. That one's down. All right, there's... Run for it! Don't protect your spawner. Iron Golem for the win right here. So, where it happened before that I got hurt was somewhere around here. I'm gonna grab all this iron, because iron is, is wonderful. Why can't I break this one? Hold on a second here. What is going on? I think I might need to re-log or something. So something is... I didn't switch to my axe. I didn't do it. I know it looked like I did, but I swear I, I didn't hit that button. It's lying. I was like, why is this wrong? I need to re-log, but it was actually my axe. I, you know, a very smart move by me there, but it's okay. It's okay. It's just an axe. And it's morning again. That shows how long we've been, like, going through this dungeon for. All right, a few more pieces of this. I wonder what we're going to have in total. All right, redstone. Not going to bother with that. Where is that evil beast that tried to kill me? It's got to be right here somewhere. I'm kind of afraid. It's lurking. Could have despawned, though. Anything could happen. Hello, zombie. So I was running before, so I may have missed something. I'm not sure. We're going to take a quick look around. And there... Oh, you know what we have to... Do? I didn't do this the whole time. Should have done this. So I can switch to cave. Wow. Look how weird that looks, right? So you can actually see the other ones. Like, let me try to get over to the corner here. Like, there's clearly one in this direction. That's lava. <laughs> there's a cave there. There's a lot of stuff around. Okay, that, that was a nice example by me. Let me try this one more time without looking as stupid. Alright, I'm like looking at the mini-map right now. I think we've killed everything down here. So it seems to be fairly safe. So if I go this way, make this turn, there's clearly something in this direction. There's, there's so much lava around. What's going on here? I think it's actually above this, yeah. That might be from our other floor or not. I'm not sure. But what you can see... Whoa. Got some lag. Calm down. Calm down. There we go. I have, You know what? It's probably just loading like some of these massive underground structures. If you look in this direction... I'm just trying to show this. It's a long episode, so I figured why not run in this direction. You can see that there's actually, like, it looks to be, like, massive amounts of these down here. Do I have torches on me? Yeah, I do. All right, let me put up a torch here. Like, it's never-ending. I can't believe how many of these spawn underground. They're not common, so I'm definitely assuming that's what caused the lag and also the crashes in the area. All right, this is going to make it easier to get to. Cave right here. Here's the other side to it. It's a tad dark in here. Oh! I hate those things! I hate them! Die! They throw so many arrows at you! Alright, it's dead. Don't worry. Ooh, some ore. Hold on a second. Onyx. Onyx is good ore. There's like so much stuff. <laughs> My inventory is dying! That's right, it's dying. That's, that's how much stuff I have. It's actually dying. Alright, so... Plenty of room for that. And as you can see... Never ending quick look for diamonds quick look for diamonds. How does this go down deeper? Oh cuz I probably went up a little huh? So yeah, there's a whole like another dungeon down here. I'm not gonna explore it though It's just too much like there How much can I possibly explore? I just wanted to see if there happened to be diamonds down here like one of those diamond rooms But yeah, you can see why there might be possible lag like if something like this loading could definitely do that. Oh my god. Redstone rooms. I wanted diamonds. No diamonds. It's not very nice. And it looks like there might even be more if you go further. I'm not sure though. Wow, it's really dark. I've aggroed everything. Oh, you are scary. Okay, leaving. If I can. Alright, I got myself in a situation here. Um, I'm stuck in a web. Was he rare? He did shoot fire at me. All right, but anyways, guys, I think this would be the perfect time to end the episode. Um, but first, the people for the fashion. There's a lot. Can't get out of this web. Let me get in here where it's safe. So um, today's winners, a bunch of them. Okay, the first one, Second Ass. That's right, that's their name. Second Ass. <laughs> Melly Doodles. Dominic Smith. 
the W Cool Man, the Bosses, Universal Strike, Julia Hesselbrock, Helen Banez, Neptune Jr., and Overlord X. So congrats to all you guys. And once again, I want to say thank you so much for 100,000 subscribers. I really appreciate it. Thanks for watching, guys. I will see you next time.